Hey everyone, it's Chad from Man Crafting, and today I'm just doing a simple test. I've picked up a couple of microphones. Uh, the first one I'm testing is the Shure MV88, and it's a, a nice little lightning adapter. It's made specifically for the iPhone with lightning adapters, and I have had a previous, I had a Rode that worked well with my previous phone, but unfortunately the adapter that I purchased never allowed me to actually use the microphone so several videos that I used my iPhone 7 on had subpar substandard audio and I've had a few people call me out on it I don't like having bad audio I don't even like listening to bad audio so I purchased these two different microphones I've got like I said the Shure MV88 it comes with this cool little case it has a windscreen on it and again it's a lightning adapter plugs right in and it's powered by the phone. I wanted to test this one. It has, I think, four or five separate audio settings uh, that basically pick up sound differently depending on what you're using it for. I happen to use it primarily for video of me speaking. Most of the other sounds that are in my videos usually don't need to be picked up with any sort of quality. It doesn't matter too much to the end result. The second one I picked up is the Zoom IQ7. It also has, as you can see here, the lightning adapter. I love how they package this. It makes it very easy to, to get to this. And I don't have to open up the whole package. But it's kind of cool. It, it pivots so you can get different directional sound. It has a gain that's on the uh, outside of the microphone right here, a little dial. It also has 90, 120, and another setting, which I'm not sure what it is. It also has uh, one thing that I think is kind of uh, cool, is an input for your headphones. So you could actually listen to your audio before doing your recording. So I just wanted to, right now what you're listening to is the MV88. I'm going to now switch out the microphones and we'll test the Zoom IQ. Currently you're listening to the Zoom IQ7. I've switched out. I had in the Shure MV88 and this is the Shure MV88 and it's got a pivoting head which is nice. It, it comes with this really nice windscreen and it's got a rubber gasket so it holds on to this pretty well. You can see here there's a microphone on all three sides so you can get broader angle of sound versus just a directional mic. So what do you think? The MV88, the IQ7, and the last one I'm going to do is no microphone at all. What do you guys think? We've got the MV88 from Shure. We got the Zoom IQ7, and currently you're listening to the internal mic. Once again, please put your comments down in the comment section and let me know which one of the three sounds the best. I'm really hoping that it's not the internal mic because I've already gotten complaints on that. It's got to be one of these two. Finish this up. I'm going to go ahead and process it and load it up to YouTube and hopefully I'll get some feedback on this today so I can make a decision and decide which one of these I'm keeping. Thanks for watching, and if this kind of content or any of the other content on my channel appeals to you, please subscribe, hit the bell button, that will let you know when I have a new video out, and as always, have a great day. Nice feature, 90 degrees. So if you're just doing, well, basically, no matter what you're doing, you're probably going to want to pivot it so you can talk directly. It is directional. You can see here when I take the